For primary school children, this is the most crucial and pivotal point of their primary school careers. And for those youngsters, it begins today with day one of the grade six achievement test, GSET. Sixth graders must take and pass the GSET exams in order to advance to the secondary level. Director of Education Edgar Howell gave an overview of how the examinations will be conducted. We will begin the grade six achievement test, GSET, for students in grade six of the majority of primary schools in the Turks and Caicos <coughs> Islands. We expect that some 473 students will write the exams in English language, mathematics, a general paper, and science. While many may have been getting in some last minute studying, grade six students at the Osito Jolly Primary School spend their last day before the test relaxing at a fun day organized by their teachers to help ease the pressure and the tension of exams. One of the students, Kimberly Harvey, said that she made great use of the day, which has also helped her in prepping for her exams. Yes, it does, because it relaxes your mind to make you focus on the GSAT. Harvey said that she had loads of fun and did relax. However, it's back to the books to get that high score she's hoping for. A lot of score. I want to be the highest, highest score ever. I, make, I want to have a scholarship for, for the GSAT. Another student, Stanley Velmere, said that his preparations also involve studying and using other resources made available to him. I've done a lot of studying and I've been on GSAT online. Too. Meanwhile, Howell also expressed that the department is looking forward to favorable results throughout the islands as this year all grade 6 students received an added studying tool. Um, we are expecting our students to do extremely well. You perhaps will recall that Mr. Drexel Seema, the CEO of Lyme, along with Althea Bean and others from Lyme, partnered with CaribbeanExams.com to arrange a facility for all grade six students writing the GSET exam to register for the online GSET with Caribbean exams. So students had exposure to, to taking tests, to having tutorials, um, to having online assistance, um, enhancing and improving their study skills. And we hope that as a result of that, the students will perform extremely well when they write the GSET exams. For WIV4 News, I'm Tian Thomas.